Hi everyone, and welcome back to the channel. With Space Marine 2 coming out this year on September 9th, I thought it was an ideal time to look back at Space Marine 1 and explain everything you need to know about the game in less than three minutes. Let's get started. It's a single-player third-person action game where you shoot and hack and slash your way through an endless amount of enemies. The game originally came out in 2011, so it looks pretty dated, although I feel it's still good enough. At least it means it runs pretty great. The game takes around 7.5 hours to finish and is currently priced at $44.99, which is a little weird given the age of the game, so definitely wait until it goes on sale. During sales, it will go 80% off at least, and the next one will be on the 27th of June. Before I tell you more about the game itself, please consider liking and subscribing. Only 1.8% of you are subscribed, and I would really like to get that number up. It would mean the world to me. Thanks in advance, and in any case, thanks a lot for taking the time to watch. Now let's continue. In Space Marine, you play Captain Titus, a giant, hulking marine who needs to mow down tons of enemies. That sounds simple, but that's what the game is. A simple B-action movie type game. It has an enjoyable story and very gory, gruesome combat that is still cool to do. Rushing literally through a bunch of orcs still puts a smile on my face. It still holds up and is just awesome to do. The action is super intense and varied due to the ability to switch on the fly between guns and melee combat. The game also uses the glory kill mechanic that Doom uses, but it actually introduced it before Doom, which is quite cool. Is that true? Or was it actually introduced even before that? Let me know in the comments if you know. Glory kills mean that you need to kill in a specific way to get your health back. This keeps the action always moving forward, because if you hang back, you will slowly lose health and eventually die. You have to kill to stay alive, which in a video game is a lot of fun. Basically, if you take it down to the basics, this game is Gears of War with some Doom, in third person, and without cover. If you plan to play it, keep in mind it's quite short, looks a bit dated, and you move a bit sluggishly. About the sluggish movement, it doesn't bother me, since it's kind of a feature of being a big space marine. Overall, the game is still tons of fun. I might make another video about it if I find more time to play it, but until then, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.